Oh, hello guys, how are you all doing? Uh, as you know, I just got the Intel A380 here and A770 behind and uh, wh why don't we do a quick experiment <laughs> if we can do something because uh, you know what I decided to try if I switch graphic card between the game will it actually uh, switch it and use the performance the other card has or not so uh, let's first see if this even works right now we got a uh, display port in A380 and uh, we see here we have a screen output and what happens if we actually go here unplug this bad boy out and plug it into this guy oh look we got the screen <laughs> so in theory this should work so let's uh, go here and uh, launch this uh, game that I have over here. Where is it? Where is it? I'm looking for, you know what? Return. Let's go. This game, man, I already have like 50 hours on it. <laughs> yeah, so what do you guys say? Will it actually work or uh, not? Let's see here. Uh, oh, I forgot to turn on MSI Afterburner. Let me quickly do that. MSI Afterburner is on. HV Info as well. Let's go. So right now we are getting about 60 FPS and what happens if we switch from A770 to A380? Let's see. Unplug this bad boy out again. We got black screen. Let's put it in A380 and see what happens. Oof. Come on. Okay. Do we got output? Oh, no luck this time, huh? Oh, it did not change the display. I'm not sure why because before it worked when we simply switched it off in desktop mode. So uh, let's try A380 now first. Oh, compiling shaders. Uh, so yeah, we are getting about 35 FPS less and... Uh, but the frame time graph is smooth. Look at that. Let's move a bit. Let's see what happens. Oh, but this is max setting, so we need to drop for sure. But that's not why we are here. Let's go and uh, unplug this bad boy out and put it there in A770. What happens then? Oh, now we got screen output, guys. But <laughs> as you can see, oh, everything got broken. And I guess what? It's still using the A380. Because uh, I'm getting 25 FPS and here I am using A770 to render, so... Uh, yeah, no, what's happening over here, I don't know, uh, but uh, let me quickly again try uh, to close this game down. Let's go here, open again Returnal. Preparing, preparing. Oh, my camera lens is not that good. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, so now we can clearly see it's running at an A770 because we are getting about 80 FPS, so that's all good. But as you can see here, the sensors and everything got broken. So, yeah, it's to be expected when you switch graphic cards like this. So, uh, yeah, let's again try and uh, unplug this uh, bad boy display port out and put it in A380. What do you think will happen? Oh, guys, we got screen back. And look, what's... What the hell is happening? What is this guys? Do you know what's happening? Uh, you know what I mean? This guys this I'm getting about 60 FPS now <laughs> Before when we were rendering with a 380 it was 25 FPS. So <laughs> Do you have any idea what's going on? Let me know guys down in the comments below. Uh, thanks for uh, being with me testing this out I really wanted to try and see what would happen uh, what do you think? Is it still using A770 even though we are displaying at A380 or uh, it's actually using A380? I would say it's still using A770 because the FPS is uh, quite bigger than uh, what we saw before when we launched the game when the cable was plugged in here. So yeah guys, let me know what do you think and make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. I'm just waiting for A750 and we will put it in here and then test it out. Do note, this is running at PCIe 3 because uh, I don't have both slots PCIe 4 as far as I know if both are connected so I have to check that. But uh, I will safely say it's PCIe 3.0 right now running and yeah, good experience, good experience. <laughs>